And most Americans will be able to file taxes on a single sheet of paper. What do you think about that, Kevin? You're still there? Or is it going to be a paper and a half, huh? Yeah. Oh, wow. President Trump is really excited about the new tax return form. <laughs> but the idea of Americans doing taxes on a postcard, it's a fantasy. The U.S. tax code, it's complicated. It's thousands of pages long, including long definitions for deductions and various loopholes for special interests. Like there's a tax credit for chicken farmers to turn poop into energy. And for Republicans, the postcard-sized tax return represents what would be a simpler overall tax code, one without deductions, tax credits, or, or multiple brackets, which is why they've been calling for it for years. Postcard-type tax return, two rates, none of the loopholes or deductions, or you can file your taxes on this postcard. Imagine a simple flat tax that lets every American fill out his or her taxes on a postcard. This postcard form will simplify the number of tax brackets by more than half. So Republicans finally got their opportunity to reform taxes in 2017. They made sure to keep that postcard promise. Notice I got the smaller version that fits in my pocket. You can barely read it, but you know. But if you compare it to the old tax form, you'll see that the new form, it's more of a condensation than a simplified form. The line that allows you to deduct your student loan interest, it's not on the postcard-sized version. But the deduction still exists, along with 11 others that used to be on the main form. They've just been moved onto a different sheet of paper, which means that now you could have to fill out as many as six other forms in order to file your tax postcard. In trying to condense the tax form onto a postcard, the IRS had to move helpful directions to an instruction book, which is 117 pages long. It's 10 pages longer than the year before. So the Republicans' biggest change to taxes was doubling the standard deduction. 90% of Americans will be able to use the standard deduction. You can fit your taxes literally on a postcard. But if any of those Americans want to take advantage of extra deductions and tax credits, they're going to have to fill out extra forms. So the complicated tax code is filled with invisible social programs and economic incentives that benefit most Americans who file taxes. That's things like the Earned Income Tax Credit, which lifted nearly 9 million Americans out of poverty in 2017, or tax credits for people to install solar panels or to buy electric cars. If taxes really could fit on a postcard, it would mean things like this probably couldn't exist. Republicans didn't get rid of many deductions and they didn't reduce the number of tax brackets. So the simpler postcard was supposed to represent simpler taxes, but taxes didn't really get any simpler, and so neither did the form. 